You'll find a lot of great models called Bubba. Now, these are not not um, horns, are they? And they're actually not even ears. A lot of people think they look like ears, but they're just feathers. Oh. And there's a great, they're called plumicorns. I love it. Everybody loves unicorns. So you'll remember it. They're called plumicorns. <laughs> and they, they're, they're, they're there for him to be able to do a few things. If he really stands really tall and puts those up in the environments he's going to be living in, in the habitats, the trees, he's going to be able to be really camouflaged and sneaky. He might put them up to say, hey, how you doing? He's <laughs> finding a girlfriend. Or he might just kind of put them down and he's like, he's like nice and chill. Now you do notice I'm able to interact and touch him. Um, he has been with us at the Science Center for almost 14 years. And um, one of the things that we have to be able to do is trim his, his talons or maybe examine his wing. So we, I have to be able to interact with him and he's very comfortable. You will notice he's doing this little panting, yeah. just like a dog uh, excretes heat, he'll do that for that. But then he's also a little bit, this is like, whoa, this is a lot of people. Um, and if I took him in a little bit like this and give him a little bit of space. Look at that, everybody's here. They've come to see you because you're amazing. <laughs> 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 